Hi, okay, so um, we've been working a bit with uh, low energy Bluetooth beacons. These are little devices that um, transmit a, uh, a intermittent um, signal on Bluetooth and they can be picked up by mobile devices. There's a couple of different uh, protocols for them, both of which we've supported. Um, so we want to show you our little reference application. And um, what this is doing is showing us that there's, there's four beacons in this room and um, it's pulling them every 100 milliseconds or something. And then um, you can see on these, on these bar graphs how many packets it's received back and how strong the signal is from each of the beacons. So um, if you look at the room, we've got one down here uh, in the wall socket and um, three more uh, loosely in the corners of the room. So, and what our app is going to try to do is give us a stateful description of which one we're closest to. Um, and we built this app to sort of get a picture of how noisy the data is and how much it's influenced by um, geometry of the room and interference from other electronic devices. Uh, it's pretty noisy, so we've done a bit of work to extract uh, meaningful data from it. So now uh, it's telling us that we're close to beacon one. And um, you can see that this signal from beacon one is pretty noisy, but we've calibrated it to go on when we're within about a meter of it. So that's looking pretty good. And then when we step away from beacon one, it should go dim after a few samples. There we go. And uh, now we'll head over to this next corner and we should get a green, sorry, no, this is beacon four. We should get an orange indication. Um, so the beacon four level is here at the bottom and we see it go on when it's received a few hits and go off when we leave. And now we should be approaching beacon three. There we go. Um, beacon three, sort of, we're a little uh, noisy on beacon three. Um, there we go. <laughs> um, and back around. So funny order. We should finally get the green one. I think it should be a little stronger than the others. Yeah, that one seems to be happy today. Um, so there you go. That's sort of an idea of the kinds of uh, range of, of, um, of accuracy you can expect out of these things. There's a lot of uh, variance. And there's also a lot of ways to set them up. So here, these are configured to really be responsive when you're very close to them. But if you just want to detect proximity, you can crank up their transmission range and just say, can you see it at all? And that's another way to go if you just want to say, am I in a building? But if you want to get sort of location within a space, you need multiple beacons and you need to be comparing their signal strength a lot. So that's what we've done. This is a little Android library. It's very easy to use and it supports um, iBeacon protocol as well as the uh, newer Alt Beacon protocol. And that's about it.